You have seriously got to be kidding me. <laughs> All right, people, how's it going? Back again with some more football content for you people here. Yes, I'm wearing a Real Madrid kit here in this video just because I'm a, I am a big fan of Jude Bellingham. Obviously, you know, uh, right here, as you can see, Bellingham, big fan of him. And also, you know, today's my birthday. I just uh, I just turned 27, so happy birthday to me. So I decided to buy myself this a birthday present here and all that. But uh, let's talk about this game right now between Valencia and Real Madrid. First of all, people need to put more respect on my man Vinicius Jr.'s name because am I the only one here who is sick and fucking tired of the Vinicius Jr. disrespect? Seriously, it's like Vinicius Jr., he's a hell of a player, he's a hell of a baller, and he, in my opinion, was the man of the match today. He just absolutely did a phenomenal, a phenomenal job. Like, seriously, Vinicius Jr., he did a hell of a job, and, you know, from the time he came to Real Madrid, I was a big follow of, follower of him, and I still am a big, massive follower of him, and it's like, uh, he, in my opinion, without a doubt, like I said, give him man of the match honors. He's earned this game. But Real Madrid should have won this game. Okay, let's be honest here. They should have won this game. The ref, I don't know what the hell is wrong with the referee, but the referee blew the whistle right as Bellingham. It looked like it was about to score. So the referee, ref just completely ruined this game. And it's like, come on, like the ref, first of all, I don't know what it is with the ref, but in my opinion, uh, the ref should be uh, sacked. Okay, it's like uh, the referee, just uh, should have let the play continue. Okay, why did the referee blow the whistle right there? Like, this is absolutely bullshit. Okay, why the hell did the ref blow the whistle right there? I have no idea, but uh, regardless of the draw, I still think uh, Madrid did a hell of a job. Well, first half, they kind of, uh, you know, didn't uh, play Madrid football. They didn't really play Madrid football until the second half, but it's like, if there is one thing I also want to say is why did Ancelotti uh, leave Modric on the bench? Like, that was really disrespectful of Ancelotti just to leave Luka Modric on the bench like that and it's like can he also stop using Tony Kroos as a defensive midfielder because if there's one thing we need to get straight here and straight to the point here is that I don't know why he's trying to experiment Kroos as a defensive midfielder okay it's like Modric uh, he should have been starting this game I don't know why he was on the bench uh, very disrespectful to just leave Luka Modric on the bench like that but yeah uh, Madrid they drew 2-2 with Valencia and you know when it comes to the Champions League uh, obviously Madrid, uh, I think they are going to win the second leg against RB Leipzig. And yeah, but uh, Madrid, they drew 2-2, two -two, but the ref, uh, but the ref completely ruined this game in my opinion. Like, come on, man. The, the play should have continued. Okay, why did he blow the whistle right there? That was just ridiculous.